Before every flight at Kunsan Air Base, an Air Combat Maneuvering Instrumentation, or ACMI pod, is loaded, secured, and ready to track the aircraft's every movement. Have you seen the movie Top Gun, where the pilot's holding two sticks and the little airplane's on the end of the sticks? Well, in modern warfare, we replace those sticks. During the pre-flight inspection, pilots insert a cartridge into the ACMI pod. The pilot then starts the aircraft, conducts an equipment check, and taxis to the end of runway, or EOR, where the pod is checked once more before takeoff. Well, at the EOR, I'm checking to make sure that the, the pod is safe for final flight. Uh, I'm checking to see if the pod is loaded properly and the pilot properly powered up the device. Once the ground crew clears the aircraft for flight, the pilot takes off for the assigned mission. The ACMI pod links with satellite data and the aircraft's own internal controls to track information which is later reviewed in the post-flight debrief. During the debrief, we can display each aircraft uh, according to where the cartridge said the aircraft was and uh, analyze in relation to other aircraft where we were, uh, what our movements were, uh, what our headings were, our altitudes, and uh, that aids us in uh, analyzing uh, our combat capabilities. We can analyze whether we were successful in employing those tactics or we were unsuccessful and also learn how we can improve for the next time. But the end of the flight does not mean the end of the workday for these dedicated workers. I will be here till at least an hour to an hour and a half after the last jet left. After the aircraft is put away and the pilot heads home, the maintainers ready the pods for the next mission. I'm Air Force Sergeant John Cronin, Kunsan Air Base, Korea.